Well, for me, or is it in the things we've done in the past have been quite uh, serious in a sense that they've been, you know, advertising campaigns and they've, you know, they've had product behind them and they've been very client driven. Whereas here, it was just about me actually having and doing something for ourselves. I want you to be very free. So we all want someone doing something for us. It's going very well, I think. It's just a fun team, that's all it is. reminds me actually of how lucky I am just in general to be able to come to places like this and you know we're, we're such a tight-knit family now you know after all these years that um, uh, it's something I look forward to and it's you know something I will keep doing for as long as they'll have me. Back a little bit and come out a little bit just so I see more of that boat. In fact maybe even go right against the boat actually. Yeah. What I enjoy the most about trips like this you know, is the cultural side of things and being able to, you know, go and explore. And, and when we, the first thing I noticed was 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 this sort of the hustle and the bustle of the city, the thousands of the bikes, um, just everywhere you go, you know, the tourists, the the vibe you go past, this loud music, everything's incredible. And and that's the first thing I noticed. And I just wanted to capture that. It's something I haven't done in Thailand before. We've always kind of stuck to the beaches and to and the resorts, but I wanted to capture something that was a little more authentic and, you know, the, the, the hustle and bustle of the city was just incredible and, and I, I wanted to really get that across and, you know, there's guys cooking on the side of the street, there's fish everywhere, there's markets, there's, you know, the people, the, the, the smoke coming up from everywhere, it's just it's such a vibe and such an energy and, and Rosette was like the first person uh, that, that I thought, that came to mind, I thought she's perfect for that, she's kind of like, a little bit different for, for that type of story, not the obvious. So she was the girl for that and it turned out so bloody good, it's so good. Well, I know that I saw it. When she's talking with her eyes, she never really means it. And I'm losing my soul in there. Town, um, so just walking on the street, trying to find the right spot. Can I take a picture of her there? Can I? Yeah, yeah. Okay, wait, let's go. We are so far from the bright side. But we were stunning, stunning movement, amazing. Oh, it was brilliant. Wow, little skip forward as the leg comes out of there. Boiling hot, like my whole face is tanning. That's how hot it is. And also the heat. It's so intensely hot because you're in this building and they block all the wind and you know everything just just accumulates into this massive overwhelming experience and it's just amazing. I love it. into town like the very busy yeah, side yeah, of the yeah. of the island the main street where all the people are on the tourist side it's kind of nice hustle and bustle and yeah it's looking good I'm, 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 looking, I'm excited about this but also she's looking fantastic I wanted her to be very free. Like I didn't want, I don't, I didn't want the, the images this year to be a posy at all. I wanted it to be, you know, very travel driven and holiday, a holiday experience. We are so far from the 
She got love, but she can't give it right now. I'm screaming at the walls like the birds don't there make it a fall down. People are just outstanding. They're just, you know, they're so helpful. They come to the street. They're all, you know, always wanting to talk to you. They always want to see what you're up to. It's quite a sensory overload. I mean, it's just so much to take in. You know, you just you just want more and more and more. It's quite a, quite an addiction, actually. I just want to go back there again and carry on going, carry on going.